Learning some new information this evening about a young man who was hit and killed by a car while he was changing a tire on a local freeway last night. Today we learned the victim played for a local football team and we are hearing from his coach. Jason Sloss is in Pacific Beach with that story. Jason. Hey there, we're at Mission Bay High School where this young man played his last football game last weekend. Last night he was killed in what appears to be a freak accident and now the rest of the team is trying to cope with the loss of a beloved teammate. It's been hard to fathom. It's just been hard to grasp. Elliot Limbrick, the head coach for the San Diego Silverbacks football team, says he and his wife Lisa, the team's general manager, are in disbelief after one of their players was killed in a collision Thursday evening. He was the glue to our team um, by his leadership, um, his caring. 22-year-old Dave Post II, a receiver on the team, was changing a flat tire in the center median along the 54 National City when another vehicle hit his car, which then struck Post. A teammate had gone to help Post and witnessed the collision, and he called Coach Kimbrick after Post was taken to the hospital. I notified the team, I notified Lisa what was going on so that our prayers can go out and, you know, we can do as all we can spiritually. And then about an hour later, less than an hour later, we got a, another phone call saying that he had, he, he didn't make it, that he had passed. Post was a second year player on the Silverbacks, which is part of the LaBelle Developmental Football League. The Limbricks say it's a tight knit team and this is like losing a member of the family. He's the kind of young man that everyone would want as a son. He would come over at least once a week take the trash out just because it was full just because not because we asked say auntie did you cook something <laughs> always send him home with food you know whatever whatever he needed and and we needed him the team plays saturday in la coach says there was never any question about playing the game they're going to have a moment of silence for him the captains are going to walk out with his number the jersey our first offensive possession play we're going to go and line up with only 10 players him being the missing player i think Everybody is really going to take the, that energy and play for Dave. Play for Dave. They say it's going to be a tough emotional game for sure. Meanwhile, the team has a GoFundMe account set up on its website to help pay for funeral costs. We have a link to that set up on our website at fox5sandiego.com. Live in Pacific Beach, Jason Sloss, Fox 5 News.